Hey gang, I just wanted to do another really quick video for you today to cover off three things. Firstly, I am well aware I misspelled independent in the uh, advert in the previous video. It has been fixed, so no need to write those uh, emails or hate forum posts. It's a, uh, a very well known fact as well that if you're a poor speller, you're going to be good at internet marketing. It's an absolute fact. Just ask uh, Ed, he'll, uh, he'll agree with me on that one. So what I wanted to do is just uh, show you how to do a really quick review of the account you've set up just to make sure nothing obscure has happened and it's all moving along uh, smoothly and in, uh, in the right direction. Now this is a review you should do maybe two, two and a half hours after you initially set up the account just to make sure it's not going in some bizarre direction. So let's jump inside the account and do this quick review together. Now I just want to go to the campaigns section and review the ads and the keywords. So I'm just going to quickly Click the add button to ensure the ad is approved and is running. So yeah, it all looks pretty straightforward. It's all the status is approved, which is all you need to really check. Then you just want to check the keywords to make sure they're all approved and again, correct. Now, there's my uh, keywords. Now, something that I noticed, which is partly why I did this video, is the status section. What it's saying here is the actual bid that I've placed of 35 cents is actually too low to have the ad displayed on the first page of the results. Uh, that's obviously not what we want. We want to get our ad uh, as close to the top as possible to start with because the ads at the top of the list get more clicks, which is going to mean a higher click-through rate, which means a stronger quality score, which will eventually mean a lower cost per click. So I'm going to change these uh, maximum bids to, let's say, $0.65 cents to start with. Hopefully that will make my ad display a little bit higher on the first page and get the... Uh, initial lot of traffic I need to get my 200 visitors and test if this is a commercially viable niche. So I've changed that cost per click there and the status is now eligible again. So we're good to go. For those of you who want to play around a little bit more, there's a, uh, a tool called the Google Traffic Estimator. And what this does, it's a tool obviously provided by Google that gives you estimates of what it expects um, your traffic levels will be based on the keywords and volume you're willing to pay. So if I simply put in here my keywords, oops, let's turn capitals off, children's sleeping bags, I'm just going to copy that and put in all three variations, the broad, the phrase, and the exact. I want to spend 65 cents per click. I'm going to spend $100 a day. My targeted language is English, obviously. Uh, countries, for ease of this demonstration, I'm just going to add all countries and territories, even though my ads are restricted to Australia, USA and Canada. And now I'm just going to hit continue. Now, this simply shows you what it expects your traffic levels will be. Now, I've always found these numbers are a little bit low. Uh, here it's saying that it thinks it's going to send me about three to six clicks per day and my ad will be in position four to six. Uh, and Therefore, my estimated cost is going to be around about $4 a day. Now, I've always found this to be quite low. Um, you'll find you will get more traffic than this, but it's a really good tool just to check to make sure your niche won't uh, send you bankrupt. In that, if you start being on a term at $0.65 cents and you're going to start getting a 1,000 visitors a day, you're going to hit your budget very, very quickly, which is uh, not necessarily a bad thing, but in a lot of cases, it's not a good thing to uh, max out your budget in the first day. So jump into the traffic estimator tool if you have time. It's definitely not necessary, but it's a cool tool to play around with and get an idea of uh, sort of the traffic that's possible through Google AdWords. And I will uh, see you tomorrow for some more AdWords stuff.